Hey, what's going on guys? It's Blue here. Today I'm going to be making a computer craft tutorial on how to make an advanced calculator. Um, just want to state this, this is not my code. I did not make it. Um, I just found it on Pastebin and um, just wanted to show you how to use it and install it and customize it to your liking. So, um, first you're going to want to go to the Pastebin link that is in the description. Um, this It's a very long code, that's why I'm not in game showing you how to do it. As you can see, it's all this. It's really a lot. So, um, maybe I'll do another um, video of me typing it all out once I actually memorize the code. But, um, yeah. What you're going to want to do is open up um, Ticket or your Minecraft or Computer Craft. Um, so, it's going to take a while f for mine to open. I don't know why Minecraft takes a long time for to open on my computer for some reason. But, um, I'll come back to you guys when that's open. Okay guys, we are back. As you can see, we have Minecraft open. Um, this little CMD thing is just, um, I use allocated memory for Minecraft so it runs faster, so that's why that's there. Well, I'm just going to open up my single player testing world. Um, just wait for that to open. And we're going to be using this computer to use it. It's a new computer, there's nothing on it. And by the way, um... Uh, I'm not going to use a Tekken launcher to show you tutorials, I'm just going to use a regular Minecraft launcher with um, Computercraft installed and other stuff like that. But um, this is just a clean computer. So now what you're going to want to do is go to run, percent, app data, percent, hit enter, and open up .minecraft, saves, and Computercraft or whatever your world is um... open up computer and then find your um... computer um... mine i know is a one and as you can see there's no programs on it so what we're gonna want to do is edit this you can just do edit calculator as you can see and then just put any random letter save it and exit so you can see there's a new file and folder now you want to edit that with Notepad++. I'm sorry for your music in the background, but um, as you can see, we got P. So what we're going to do is go back to the advanced calculator code. We're going to copy all of it. Just go down and highlight everything all the way to main loop. Hit copy. Come back. And it's not letting me paste for some reason. But um, control V works. And then just hit file, save and um, hit reboot on the computer and sorry if you hear my cat in the background meowing um, so now what you're going to want to do is type in calculator or I spelled it wrong calculator as you can see um, welcome to who's boost calculator enter one expression per line Enter problems using format below, which is 1 plus 1, 1 minus 1, 1 times 1, 1 divided by 1 with the slash. Enter quit to quit. So as you can see, this does work. If I do 5 plus 5 and hit enter, enter 10. And these do go up to big numbers, as you can see. Plus. And it still gives you the answer. Um, so yeah, uh, I'm going to do like 500 times 500 does work so you know I think it goes up to six digits or seven or eight I, I think it's eight to be honest I'm not really sure once again this is not my code but um as you can see if you type in quit it does quit and I'm just gonna show you how to edit it to your liking so as you can see if you go to the bottom of the code and it's it, you'll see the print welcome to who's blues calculator you can change this to your name or whatever or change whatever you want it to say here and um, that's basically it. And remember, before you exit Notepad++, hit File Save, which I already did. As you can see, I can close it now. So now if I type in Calculator, this comes up. And yeah. So thanks for watching, guys. Um, it's been Blue here. This is a tutorial on how to make an advanced calculator in computer craft. So once again, thanks for watching. Like and subscribe, and see you next time.